Hello everyone, I am Shaman, CSAT faculty at Inside IS. I welcome you once again for the question of the day. At the beginning, we will take the bouncer of yesterday's question. This was the yesterday homework question. A number is divided by 114 leaves the remainder 39. When the same number is divided by 19, find the remainder. This was the question. Now look here. For example, when I divide 27 by 5, okay, a normal long division method. This is 5 times, okay, where this is called the quotient and this is the dividend and this is the divisor, okay. So, today we learned divisor which is also called factors and this is the remainder. Now, if I consider this as m, this as x, this as a and this as r, x is the divisor, m is the dividend a is the quotient and r is the remainder. So, I can write this m in the form of m is equal to x into a plus r, is not it? Where x into a 5 into 5 is 25 plus 2 which is nothing but 27. Now, similarly, there is one number m which when divided by 114, okay, the divisor is 114, let us say a times and the remainder is 39, okay. Let us consider this is the number 114a plus 39 is the number. Now, when this number is divided by 19, okay, we got this number and when I divide this number by 19, what is the remainder? In this kind of cases, see, look whether 114 is divisible by 19. Yes, it is completely divisible. 114 gets completely divisible by 19 6 times, is not it? So, when you divide 114 by 19, 114 into anything, you put at the place of any positive integer okay, or negative integer. 1, 2, 3, anything you put, it will get divided, right? So, this whole number is getting divided. Now, check this number, 39. 39, when I try to divide by 19, okay, it is not going to divide completely because the remainder will be 1 here. 39, when divided by 19, 19 to 2 times is 38 and the remainder will be 1 in this case. So, in this whole number, when I divide by 19, the remainder will be 1. Okay. In a very simple way, you just check whether this 114 is divisible by 19. 114 if divisible by 19. If it is getting divided, then check whether this 39 is divisible by 19. Okay. If not dividing, then whatever the remainder you are getting here, the same remainder would be the answer here. Okay. Answer would be 1. Most of you guys have given a correct answer in the comment section. Okay. And this is the question of today. A person was facing northwest at point A. Then he turned 90 degree to his right then 180 to degree to his left and 90 degree anti-clockwise. In what direction is facing now? Whenever there is a direction questions, remember this one. From this point, always right means this one. Okay. From this point, right is this one. From this point, right is this one and from this point, right is this one. Right is always clockwise direction. Similarly, this is left, left, left and left. Okay left will be always anti clockwise okay right is always clock and left is always anti clockwise now a person was facing northwest at point a then he turned 90 degree to his right then 180 degree to his left and 90 degree anti clockwise anti clockwise means left in what direction he is facing now okay always in the direction question plot the direction first okay direction symbol he was facing northwest. This is north and this is west. Between north and west, northwest. Okay. He was facing initially at this point. Then he turned 90 degree to his right. Okay. 90 degree means this is what 90 degree. Okay. 45 degree, 45 degree. Every direction is being made for an angle of 45 degree. Okay. This is 90 degree to his right. Then he turned 180 degree to his left. 180 degree means 90 again 90. This is what he is located now and again 90 degree anti-clockwise. See, 90 degree anti-clockwise means see, always this is anti-clockwise means he is traveling in the same direction. 90 degree means he will be at this point. So, what is this direction? This is east and this is south between south and east that is southeast. Okay. Now, in these kind of questions, initially he went see, right 90 degree, left 180 degree and again left 90 degree can I say, okay, anti-clockwise is left 90 degree. 
always see if he travels right 90 degree and left 90 degree he will be coming to the same position right if he is travelling from this point right 90 degree and left 90 degree left 90 degree he will be at the same point without any displacement means whenever he travels right 90 left 90 it will get cancelled so whatever the remaining will be your answer means initially he was at this position which is nothing but northwest then he took 180 degree left means 180 degree left is diagonally opposite to northwest which is nothing but southeast okay now in this kind of question he might not give you only multiples of 45 degree only that is 45 90 180 225 and so on okay in those cases you add all the right you add all the left and cancel out whatever the remaining that would be your answer and this is the bouncer of today okay this is your homework question okay very similar to whatever the question we have done today apply the same technique because here one of the angle is 125 degree okay these are all degrees angle here 120 degree 125 degree 90 degrees and this is also 100 degrees here okay see we cannot plot this 100 degree neither 125 degree easily without a protractor hence you have to go by addition and take the difference okay whatever you will get that will be in the difference of 45 degree okay solve this question and put the answer in the comment section Thank you.